first of all, Ashreinu Matov Chalkin. I mean, there's no nation on earth like this. I want to talk about something from a different angle. I, I think it's very important. You know, people asked of all of the places that, all the places that these things happened in that people are going to see, you know, why do we choose here? It's not one of the more pleasant uh, circumstances. Who are the kids that came to this festival? Why'd they come here? It's known a nice percentage of them were actually kids of Haredi homes. Not exclusively. But all of them, why'd they come here? They're looking for something. They're looking to connect. They're looking for spirituality looking for love. Things that they didn't find. They didn't find in, in Haredi society. You know, we're guilty. We're guilty. Why do Jewish kids have to look elsewhere? We never reach them. They don't know that Hashem loves them. We, we never taught them that. We never taught them that Yiddishkeit is spiritual. They didn't know that there's so much love in the society. Role, and for many in Haredi homes. We didn't get to them. So Hashem had to get to them by other means. <laughs> We've got to do tshuva. Certainly, every, we have to reach every Israeli kid. How could it be? Kids growing up in Eretz Yisrael and kids growing up in Haredi homes. They have to look elsewhere.
Hashem is speaking to us. We're, we're the ones. We're the ones that He's speaking to. We who know. I think we have to leave here determined. We have to leave here determined that we've got to find a way to reach every kid in Eretz Yisrael. We've got to change the image our society portrays of what it means to be a from Jew. It's not just the media. Ourselves. We have to know that to be a from Jew means to care, to love. The Torah is filled with meaning, wisdom, practical wisdom, relevant wisdom. Every kid in Eretz Yisrael has to know that. We've got to get the message across. We've got to do what we can to get, to get the people to know, to feel an is for everybody. To make sure that the image we're portraying of from Jews is one that's makarav and not marachik. Got to work on our own. We've got to reach everybody. I hope everyone here was moved. I hope we'll all be thinking. And I hope eventually we'll all be doing. Because the tragedy here was speaking to us. We know. We understand. Hashem speaking to us. Every Jewish kid that was killed here. Everyone that was wounded. Everyone that was captured. It's because we didn't get to them. Let's not forget that. We bear the responsibility. They didn't know any better. We're the problem. We've got to get the message. That's the only, the only answer to this crisis. It's the only way out. Please stay with this experience. Don't forget it. Don't forget it. You saw a mother of a hostage pleading for Kali Yisrael to keep Shabbos, and for anyone who can to influence others to keep Shabbos. No. Hashem should help. We shouldn't forget. He should give us the wisdom, the resolve, and bring back Kali Yisrael. <laughs> and then we should be Zalcha to the Gula Shalim. Amen.